Hi everyone, what is up? It's your girl Tosca. This is going to be my birthday haul. Stuff that I got this week um, for my birthday. So thank you you guys for the birthday wishes and um, I want to thank a very special person who has been a subscriber to my channel since I started really. She's She started following me back in I believe April of last year and that's April or May of last year and she um, she moved here to Atlanta from South Africa so shout out to you Zoe and she's pretty much more of a friend now than ever so I'm really happy that she's in my life <laughs> so my start to this haul is I'll start first with the crystals so I went to the crystal store my first one is this beautiful amethyst necklace I love it I love it I'm so glad that I got it I got it for myself and then I got this rose quartz heart it's beautiful okay and then I got this beautiful, I don't know how to pronounce it, Zoisite, Z-O-I-S-I-T-E. It's green, and if you look closely, there's little, like, magenta specks on there. It's really pretty, okay? And lots of healing qualities to this particular stone. I like it. You can find it. Um, it's called Zoistite. It's really nice. <sighs> okay. And she did. Zoe gave me this really beautiful painting that she made of my cats. Isn't that cute? That is the cutest thing ever. Ever, ever, ever. I love, love, love. So I'm going to put that on my altar. And I also got an amazing manifestation journal. And it's got... I love it. And I love flowers. I love flowers, you guys. Flowers make me freaking happy. <laughs> I love flowers, I love plants, I love anything like that. And I got something really exciting that I'm going to use on my channel. So today Zoe was like, oh, let's go to a metaphysical store. And so I said, okay. So we went to this metaphysical store in Roswell. Um, and she goes to me and she's like, She's like, pick out any tarot deck that you want. And I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. And they had the freaking goddess tarot deck. I don't know if you guys know this, but um, the goddess tarot deck was my very first tarot deck that I got in 2004, 2003 through 2004, something like that. And, um... It was given to me by a witch from Salem, Massachusetts. So I went to, I ran away. <laughs> a long story short, I ran away to Boston <laughs> um, when I was in high school. And I ended up going to, um, from New York to Boston. And then I went to go um, to Salem. And over there, I got my very first tarot deck. Sabrina, what are you doing? Sabrina. But anyway, I lost that deck. And so I was manifesting. I was like, I'm going to get that deck again as a gift. Sabrina, stop. I'm sorry. <gasps> uh, but anyway, I have it. Yay! Exciting! And this is like the full thing. It has like 
the book. The other one that I had did not have the book. This has the book and this is the full deck. So like this is six of pentacles. How pretty that is. Seven of pentacles. King of pentacles. The tower. Let's see some other cards. King of swords. Beautiful. Like the illustration is so beautiful. The lovers. Um, Eight of cups. Two of pentacles. Let's see. What other ones is there? Um, the Fool, Judgment, The Star, how beautiful. Three of Wands, Nine of Cups, Queen of Cups, and the Ace of Cups. It's beautiful. And I'm going to end it with the Ten of Pentacles. It's beautiful. So just to show you what I got, um, I'm super excited to use this deck freaking finally like and she even told me like Zoe even told me it's like I think you read differently when you use this deck and I'm like every deck um, is different and again not all tarot readers are the same so just keep that in mind you guys I know there's people who are like you're just interpreting it's like no well part of it is that but like part of it is also like I don't read like other readers and I definitely would never sugarcoat how I read like I'm I'm very pragmatic like I'm a very like this is the world we live in so you have to just deal with it but anyway yeah, so that is what I got. And then from Sephora, I'm not a big makeup person. Like, I won't go out of my way to get, like, the new thing. Because that's just not who I am. But, I did get a Sephora lip gloss. It's beautiful. It is in the color Brilliant something. I don't even know what color it is, but it's like a peachy pink. I love, by the way, Sephora's lip gloss. I just, it's astounding to me how amazing their lip gloss is. I don't know why I never went out of my way to get one, but it's in number six, Sunshine. So it's like a peachy, kind of bright, orangey color. Coral, coral, I think. But yeah, nice. Then I got myself a nice lip balm from Sephora. Again, this is in number one, Apricot. Or Apricot. Apricot. And then... Um, I'll probably open this for you guys. This is the Sephora Sephora um, blush, and this is in the color Snapdragon. <laughs> some of these, some of these names, man, like, like are just really crazy. So this is the packaging. And let me see. Yeah, so it's like a compact. Super pretty. I love the contrast. Okay. And then, well, Sephora also was going through a sale. So that's why I kind of went all out. <laughs> I'm not really big, you know, to shop around for my makeup, but... I decided what the hell it's my birthday and then I got destination eyeshadow or like their destination line product line and it's in the it's in the palette off the grid 
So they had different ones. They have like island and you know other like in the jungle and stuff. But then this is like off the grid and I really loved the colors. I just absolutely love. I needed a new palette anyway, you guys. Like I was running out, running out, but this is the palette. It's really beautiful. It's very neutral. And I just, yeah, I just get real neutral colors because I can't really go to work looking like a clown <laughs> or looking like I'm going to a runway show or like a fashion show. You know, when I go to work, I'm working with little kids. Right? I'm not exactly there to impress anyone. <laughs> but yes, so this is... The Sephora collection destinations off the grid. I think, yeah, like the back shows like the names of the colors and stuff. And then I got myself the real reason why I went to Sephora was to get myself a really good uh, cleanser, like face. And so this is Tatcha Dewy Cleanse and Hide. Tatcha Dewy Cleanse and Hydrate and I got like the travel size version because I just I don't know if I'm gonna use I don't know how I'm gonna react to it so I didn't want to buy like the big ass bottle so this is the face wash this is actually made with rice water rice water and Uh, I don't know what else. It's made with with rice water and something else. I think it has um like cucumber stuff. I don't know, whatever. Anyway, that's what it looks like. It's very pretty. Like the bottle is very. Pretty. That's the one thing I will say that I love about uh, Japan is that they have this. Um, heart for they their art is to be simple they like simplicity and then this is the moisturizer okay and that I feel like is everything I can't show you the other stuff I got but I did um, because I ate it all <laughs> like I had my own cake and I had my own whatever but this is probably the best birthday I've had well actually it wasn't really the best birthday um no this is probably the best birthday I've had from my friends um it was a little bit disappointing because my family forgot my birthday my brother forgot my birthday and if I didn't tell my mom because my mom was the only one who texted me and I was like did everyone just forget my birthday like I know it's on a Thursday but like why did you you know anyway whatever everyone else all my friends and all my subscribers wished me a happy birthday so I'm fine so <laughs> alright hold on let me get one card for you guys one card for my collective Bless your heart. Reach out for emotional and spiritual support to heal and mend your heart. Mend your heart, everyone. Have a good day and enjoy. I am so glad that um, my cats are not being crazy right now because they were being crazy earlier. This is like take four, take five. So, thank you. Bye.